What is up, Ladder Climbers? This is Antoine Wade, Six Figure Earner and Millionaire. And in today's video, we are going to be discussing a database administrator. Welcome back to the Black Heights channel, where we talk about all things related to the skill development in the IT sector. Now, before we get to the video, guys, do me a stone cold favor and stump that like button as it helps us grow the channel. And guys, we are going to be discussing what is a database administrator, what are the skills required to be a database administrator, how to become a database administrator with your education, the average salary for a database administrator, and last but not least, the career path for a database administrator. Without further ado, let's jump into what is a database administrator. Well, a database administrator is someone who uses software to store and organize data. So they organize data such as financial records, warehouse records, customer shipping records, and many other. They make sure that the data is available and it is secure for unauthorized access. So data is protected and companies need their data protected in order to save themselves from getting hacked. And database administrators are often called DBAs and they make sure that data analysts can easily access the database to find information that they need in order for them to perform business operations and in order for them to make sure that the business is getting the data that they need to make an informed decision. And DBA sometimes work with the organization's management team to understand the company's data needs and to make sure that there's a plan to store this data inside a database. And there are two common types of specialties for DBAs. One, a system DBA and an application DBA. System DBAs are responsible for physical and technical aspects of the database, such as installing upgrades and patches to fix program bugs. Application DBAs support a database that has been designed for a specific application or a set of applications such as customer service software, marketing software, human resources software. What are some of the key skills you Soft need to skills? become a good database administrator? Well, one, you need to be patient. Two, you need to have meticulous attention to detail. This is a detail oriented role. You also need to be able to be logical in your approach to work. You need to have the ability to prioritize multiple tasks and you need to have a good amount of problem solving skills. So experience Hard with databases skills. is the number one skill. You need to understand disaster recovery. You need to have customer service skills. You certainly need to have SQL skills, Linux skills, and there's plenty other skills, but I would say the top five are experience with databases, disaster recovery, customer service skills, SQL skills, which is very important, and Linux skills. One thing about database administrators, it is best to get a certification because the certification may provide you with a competitive advantage over others. And there are some firms and some companies out there that do require that database administrators have a certification. So how to become a database administrator? Well, most database administrators have a bachelor's degree in management information systems or a computer related IT related field. And with doing research about 54% of database administrators have a bachelor's degree and 13% hold an associate's degree and about 8% have a master's degree. So if you think about it, the majority of database administrators do have a bachelor's degree and I would say you probably want to get a bachelor's degree in management information systems, one of the best majors out there, if you are thinking about becoming a database administrator. Let's talk about the salary of database administrators because this is where the rubber meets the road and the average database administrator makes about $74,000 per year, equating to about $35 an hour. And folks who are just starting in the career, entry level, you're going to make about $57,000 a year, more than the average person in the United States. The average growth rate for a database administrator is about 9%. And here are some of the roles for database administrators in Austin, Texas. And as a database administrator, as you become more experienced and you start to take on more responsibilities, one of the things that you can go into is leadership. 
And there's other roles that database administrators can go into as well, such as becoming a consultant, an information technology manager, a project manager, some sort of analyst, some sort of manager of applications development. There's many roles that a database administrator can go into, but the next role typically, once you become a database administrator, is going into some sort of management role and climbing the corporate ladder. And if you are a detail-oriented person, you are organized and you like working in a structured environment, you might want to consider a career as a database administrator. So guys, my take on a database administrator is that it is a fantastic job. It is a role that will give you an ample opportunity to make a lot of money. It is a six figure job and also will give you the opportunity to climb the corporate ladder because you will be interacting a lot from day one with management of the actual company that you're working for to understand their data needs, to make sure that it is secure and make sure that it is protected. So guys, I do recommend this career as a management information and systems major and this is one of the careers that i looked into as a management information systems major but i wanted to be a software engineer and guys i hope you have enjoyed this video do me a favor and leave me a comment on any of these points that i have made in this video also if you like this sort of content do me a favor hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell to be alerted when i drop that new content and until next time y'all peace